up, everybody? It's your boy, Harper Fitness, a.k.a. Hashtag Games. Before I start this video, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. Stay up to date with all my motherfucking videos. Follow me on Instagram at Harper Fitness and follow my band, Divided Dimension on Spotify. All that shit will be in the description box below. Today, I have Precision, Precision Research, M-V-P-E-R-E. -E. I fucked that up. M-V-P-R-E or M-V-P-R-E. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, this is the watermelon lemonade flavor. So I do want to thank um, Innova Farm is actually the parent company that owns Precision Research. Uh, Innova Farm did send this shit over for free. So I really do appreciate them for sending me it over and giving me the opportunity to review it on the channel. I've been wanting to try this. I actually wanted to try the, uh, the, the candy necklace flavor. That shit looks so good on the pictures and shit. But they sent me watermelon lemonade. Hey, I'm not going to complain. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to complain over here. Um, so this is a half a scoop to one scoop serving. So it does say 40 servings, but it's actually 20 if you're a stem junkie. And let's be honest, I'm a stem junkie. So for price point, you're looking at 20 scoops at $50 on their website. You might be able to get it cheaper somewhere else, but that's just on their website. So obviously that is in the higher upper $2.50, $2.50 a scoop. Um, if you were a kind of a noob and intermediate, you might get away with doing a half a scoop for 40 servings. In that case, you're looking at a little bit over than a dollar a serving. Um, but let's be honest, I'm a stem junkie. So I'm going to go ahead and go over the label as a full scoop and tell you what I think of the dosages and what the, uh, what the effects are and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? So let's go ahead and get it open. Let's go ahead and get it started with, uh, yeah, vitamin B12 coming in at, at um, well, actually, you have niacin at 15 milligrams, which is 75% of your daily. You have vitamin B12 at 1,000 micrograms, which is 16,667% of your vitamin B12, which is obviously a lot of vitamin B12. Your, that vitamin B12 is going to give you a lot of energy for sure. Um, so, yeah, that's in there for energy. You got pump performance matrix, citrulline, malate coming at 8 grams. That's obviously a nitric oxide boosting. It's going to help with vasodilation. Um, eight grams. It's a pretty solid dosage. Um, it's malate, so it's a two to one ratio. So you're really only going to get like four grams of L-citrulline, um, and usually the dosage is around three to six. So that's a pretty good dosage for pumps. Um, but it's not going to work by itself. Usually you need more ingredients to help, which other than just citrulline. You have beta alanine at three point two, standard dosage. Standard dosage. You got Hydromax coming in at two grams. Glycerol powder, sixty-five percent. Two grams glycerol. Is basically um, it's Hydromax, uh, which is the patented version of glycerol. Um, it's gonna help with uh, dehydration and improve performance. Helps with pumps. It's gonna help pair up with uh, the citrulline malate. Then you also have agmatine sulfate at one gram. Pretty solid dosage of agmatine. Um, agmatine helps with uh, pumps as well. So that's gonna pump. That's gonna pair very well with the other three pump ingredients. Um, and that's the pump and performance matrix right there. Then you have the cognitive stem matrix, which is choline bitrate coming in at 500 milligrams. Choline bitrate, that's a solid dosage. Usually it's around 250, 250 to 500. Um, helps encourage muscle cells to contract efficiently and may help suppress fatigue. It's also a precursor to the acetylcholine and neurotransmitter to the vital nerve function, direct signaling of muscular contractions. Um, and then you have tyrosine coming in at 500 milligrams. I'm a big fan of tyrosine. Tyrosine is going to help with uh, focus, a little bit of uh, euphoria feeling. Um, 500 milligrams, pretty solid dosage there. Can't complain about that. And then you have... Um, tyrosine is also going to help with uh, cognitive performance and helps reduce uh, the per perception of stress during a workout. So go longer, essentially. Um, caffeine and hydrous, 350 milligrams. Pretty solid dosage. Pretty solid dosage. Immediate energy, obviously. Um, pretty, pretty solid dosage there. Um, I mean, you can have more, you can have less, but I feel like 350 is kind of like in the uh, middle range these days with caffeine. Um, Biophytum DC extract, 150 milligrams. Biophytum is an anti-inflammatory, so it's gonna help the. Uh, it's gonna help you know. It's an anti-inflammatory. So then you have raw alcyon. Raphael Sepertinia, basically that's alpha yo, two milligrams. Two milligrams shouldn't fuck me up too much. I feel like two milligrams I've gotten away with in a lot of pre-workouts. Uh, I'm not usually a fan of alpha yo. Over two usually is when it starts fucking me up. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try to do a full scoop and see what happens. Hopefully I'm not a. Uh, hopefully I don't fucking die. Well, 
Hopefully, I, 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 do, I don't not enjoy my workout. Hopefully, I enjoy my workout. And then you have Huperzine A. Uh, Huperzine A is basically uh, 100 micrograms of that. Um, Huperzine is basically... Um, well, uh, first of all, it's usually around 100 to 200 micrograms. Um, that's at 100, so it's a little bit on the lower end as far as Huperzine is concerned. Helps with cognitive performance and muscular endurance. So you combine all that shit together, you have a pretty solid pump uh, profile, and you have a pretty solid actual pre-file, uh, pre-workout energy and focus, and a little bit of euphoria. Um, you're kind of uh, dipping in all the aspects on this. Um, I feel like this is like an overall good pre-workout for like all of it. You know what I'm saying? It's not just a pump pre-workout. It's not just a pre-workout pre-workout. It's not just an energy focus pre-workout. It's kind of got like the best of everything here. So um, it does say massively dosed, high impact pre-workout. It says nootropic, nootropic infused. Um, obviously some of the ingredients I went over are more, uh, they're more nootropic and uh, focus and shit like that. Um, 100% fully disclosed, obviously no prop blends, no artificial colors. Um, yeah, so it says, uh, it says Wayne Gretzky and all these other people, some of the most notable MVP recipients in the history of sports. Precision Research MVP is the most valuable pre-workout in the history of sports nutrition loaded with massive recording settings. Clinical proven dosage of the most if important ingredients to fill your body to help dominate the most intense workouts of your life, nothing but the fully loaded ingredients and fully loaded pump strength and endurance. I'd have to say that that's pretty accurate. I mean, it's pretty much dipping in into all of the categories. You know, it's not just a nootropic base. It's not just a pump base. It's not just a focus base. It's not just a, you know, energy based. It's kind of got like a solid dosage, you know, nothing crazy, but a solid dosage of everything. So, so I'm going to go ahead and do one scoop into, uh, this is 14 ounces. It says to do one scoop for, uh, 10 to 16. So I did, uh, I did 14 ounces here. Obviously there's no artificial colors and that smells juicy. I can just smell the watermelon. It smells like a juicy watermelon. All right. Shake it up, give it a fair, I don't even got a, uh, I just realized I don't even have a ball in here. So it's literally just, this is a fair shake up here. No, no uh, blender ball action. Yay. All right, so as you can see, foamed up about right here is foam. Yeah, you can see it, there you go. It's dissipating pretty good. Looks like it mixed very well for it not being uh, there's a little bit of floaty action on the bottom. Nothing crazy. Ah. So, the uh, lemonade bitter, like pucker your lips type of feel comes in immediately. Um, and then also watermelon comes with it. So it's like, it kind of comes at the same time and it kind of tapers off with like a lemonade feel. It's pretty solid. Um, it's definitely got that bitter, like pucker feeling to it. It's pretty good though. I mean, if you're a fan of like solid lemonades, you'll probably like this. Um, definitely watermelon comes kind of, uh, more lemonade based and, and less watermelon, but you could definitely tell watermelon's in there. It's kind of like, it kind of lingers, but it's not like the, the dominant taste in this. Um, but overall, I feel like the flavor is probably, keep in mind the water, I should have put, I should have put ice in it. I always fucking drink my shit with ice, so that way it's nice and cold. This is like tap water almost. It's cold, but it's not like insanely cold. As far as taste, it's a solid. It's, it's pretty enjoyable. Especially if you're a lemonade fan and shit like that. Um, so I'm going to give this a solid... I feel like 8.5 or 8. I'm going to stick with an 8. 
I'm going to give it this, the, the flavor, an 8. And I'm going to start running this shit for probably a solid week. I feel like week's a good representation of a pre-workout to know whether you like it or not or what you thought of it. So I'm going to run this shit for a week, and I'll be back to wrap up my thoughts on this pre-workout. So you guys stay tuned. All right, guys, back here to wrap up my review on Precision Research MVP. -E. Yeah. All right, so I did do um, one scoop for about a week. I think I got like four or five workouts in. Um, so just it's enough to, you know, give my final opinion on it. Um, so I did do one scoop, which is 20 servings. So keep that in mind. Um, obviously... So I would have done more. I would have done like a scoop and a half maybe just to get like an over edge on the, you know, total ingredients. But that fucking alpha yo was fucking me up at one scoop. So I was like, fuck it. I ain't doing that. So right off the bat, um, let's just go over all the ingredients here. So the, the pump and performance matrix, pretty solid. My pumps were pretty, pretty good. Pretty good. Um, that's actually in the Hydromax, Agmentine Sulfate. All that stuff worked really solid with pumps. So right off the bat, this is a great for pumps for sure. Um, I was having vascular, I was having vascularity everywhere. I have really good vascularity anyway, but the shit was coming out really fucking well, really well. Um, obviously, it ain't coming out well right now because I just woke up. But um, so this is great for pumps for sure. Um, once you get into the, uh, the the cognitive stem matrix. So the 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 energy pretty solid, right? 350 caffeine right off the top. You got the tyrosine, you got the choline bitrate in there. Um, huperzine, um, pretty pretty basic stim package, right? But I felt like it was pretty good. Um, I definitely was focused for a while and just in the zone for for a while. So um, I thought it was pretty good. I don't think it was anything over the top, but I think it was definitely right where you want it especially at like a stim junkie uh stage and for a stim junkie one scoop does it you know what i'm saying you can feel it you can feel everything but i would have done more if it wasn't for the fucking alpha yo so right off the top the alpha yo that two milligrams it comes in weak but it comes in where you know it's there and that, that was fine and i'm okay with alpha yo but once i start sweating my ass off and i start getting that cold sweat and like I'm cold I don't like it right so there was a couple nice days where it was nice as fuck out and I was already starting to get the chills and kind of like cold sweats as I was working out at the gym because they had the door open and shit and it was nice out I'm like man I fucking hate Alpha Yo so much so you do get a little bit of cold chills but it's not like enough to like make you feel like you're sick it was just like oh shit I'm sweating my ass off I'm starting to get a little cold chills type of deal um, so not a fan of the alpha yo, right? But that's not a make or break type of deal. Um, when you're doing one scoop, so it's, uh, it's not bad. So, um, if I had did a scoop and a half, that alpha yo would have fucked me up probably for sure. So I kept it at one scoop, um, for like four or five workouts and I felt like it was pretty good overall. My only complaint is the alpha yo really. I didn't like the alpha yo side effects. I never like alpha yo, but everyone knows that by now. Um, but two milligrams wasn't enough to make me not like this product. It was just enough to know that it's there. Like I knew the alpha yo was there for sure. Um, so overall, I think this is a great pre-workout. I wish they would take out the alpha yo or drop it down to micrograms, not milligrams. Micrograms don't do shit to me, but milligrams, that shit does some stuff to me. So I don't know. Take it for what it is. I think it's a great pump, pump, pump pre-workout for sure. The, uh, the, uh, you know, the, the nootropic effect and the stim package, pretty good for a stim junkie, nothing over the top. And I did do one scoop the entire time. So this is a one scooper if you're a stim junkie, but I would have done a little bit more to kind of get that edge, kind of get that like super, super want to fuck some shit up type of deal. So I like to do that, but I think for a stim junkie, one scoop will definitely do the trick. And if you like Alpha Yo, you might even want to scoop in a quarter it or maybe scoop in a half it. And I think you'd really get the edge on you. And you'd really get a good fucking, really get a good uh, workout in. So, um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much what I thought of it. And uh, that's my thoughts. So, 
Once again, I want to thank uh, Research Precision Research for sending me this over, um, aka in an over form. Really appreciate it. Um, yeah, so that's my uh, that's my thoughts on it. So, uh, as far as the nootropic effect, I had some nootropic action, nothing crazy, but I definitely was dialed in and felt focused, and energy was there too. So, uh, yeah. So that's me pretty much it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for the support as always. Let me know what you want to see next. And if you don't like it too fucking bad, subscribe, share, like, and comment below. Scroll but don't troll. And don't hate me because I'm fucking swole. Don't forget to follow me on all social media. I'm from Fitness. Facebook, I'm from Fitness. Snapchat, I'm from Fitness. Instagram, I'm from Fitness. Don't forget to like my band page, Divide Dimension on Facebook. Follow my band, Divide Dimension on Spotify. And shop all of your supplement needs at tigerfitness.com. Using my affiliate link, which will be in the description box below. And if you guys want to happen to check this shit out, go to Anova Farms website for Precision Research. Uh, I'm not sure which one this will be on oh it says precision research usa go to precision research usa to check this shit out and other than that that's gonna be pretty much it for this video so i'll check you guys later